Sky Isle feels so peaceful most of the time. That's why I like it here. A respite from all the chaos of the mainland. The temperature of the text, text is quite it, it. it facilitates all sorts of strange and beautiful things. Some precious cargo was supposed to sail in on the morning tide, but it never arrived. The people need to believe we have things under control. Long ago, we druids left Tamriel and its troubles behind us. But here, our ancient ways survived. I believe a knight should not be measured by the worth of their weapon, but by the allies they keep. These manifestations of the island's fiery hearts reveal the majesty and power of the natural order. Nature itself has fallen out of balance. Storm and fire will bring down the old machines. Noi. Tommonen, tommonen alkuintro. Mä itse asiassa, se näkyy vaan kerran, niin mä jouduin niin kun korvaamaan alkuperäisen pelin intron tolla, eli vaihdoin vain tiedostojen nimi. Sen takia siinä oli toi, toi vääränlainen, vääränlainen tosiaan tekstitys. Tätä on tullut te pelattua, tätä ei soo tosi paljon. Siis aloitin 2014 beta-testaajana ja tosiaan. Over here? I could use your help. Kuvaa Sama sama mies tää. Peli al al alkaa tästä jos teet uuden hahmo. High Isle is a good place for an adventurer to earn some gold. Provided you have the right connections. The name's Jakarn. My patron needs someone like you. An unknown, so to speak. It'd be worth your time to befriend her. Joho, hyvä herra. Minä olen Dipellan uh, ritari, totta kai autan teitä. Lady Arabelle DeVoe. Ah, lady. Maybe you've heard of her. She's a famous investigator and author. Diplomat too. Which is why she's here. She runs in circles way above my station. <laughs> But I owe her a debt that I'm trying to pay. Maybe you can help me do that. Yeah. A fair bit of gold, most likely. Tantutu siis kampanjasta täytyy. Lady Arabelle works for one of the richest nobles in all Tamriel. Lord Bakaro Valoris. He's sponsoring an important conference here on the island. But there's a problem. Trust me. The payday will be worth it. Lady Arabelle will appreciate an outsider's perspective. She's at the Gonfalon Bay docks with Lord Bacaro, if you want to introduce yourself. The problem I mentioned, it involves some missing ships. Anyway, tell her Jakarn sent you. I'm her favorite. Long story. It involves multiple maidens, a few princes, <laughs> and one charming rogue who stole all their yeah, lives. Yeah, how many know who authorities got involved. Uh -huh. Fortunately, Lady Arabelle agreed to take responsibility for my good behavior. Now I owe her. Omistettu mies. I have a keen eye for talent, my dear, and you're practically oozing it from your pores. I am Lady Arabelle DeVoe. If you're looking for gainful employment, I have a proposition for you that pays exceedingly well. Care to hear more? Oh, nothing tawdry, my dear. We'll be too busy for romantic shenanigans before long, I expect. <laughs> Some precious cargo was supposed to sail in on the morning tide, but it never arrived. I need someone not known around the island to be my eyes and ears. While tales of my exploits credit me with all sorts of talents, I can't be in more than one place at a time. I could use a fresh face to mingle with the locals. Determine if anyone knows anything about my three missing ships and their cargo. Lord Bakaro's conference can't proceed without that cargo. Mixi. Here's what I need you to do. Check the inn, the lighthouse, and the lock of Bane Shallows. See if anyone knows or saw anything. Then meet me outside the north gate to compare notes. <laughs> me? 
Aa, niin, niin tämä on kirjoittanut Investigator Veilin tarinat. Tämä on niin kuin tämän Elder Scrollsin Agatha Christie, Investigator Veil-tarinat. <laughs> oh, pish posh. Do these look like the ink-stained fingers of a writer of overly imaginative and lurid tales to you? I'm rather fond of the baldy investigator and her adventures, though. They remind me of my younger days. Eli joku bardi on kirjoittanut ne. I'm overseeing security for the conference. A few months ago, Lord Bacaro approached me, explained his grand plans and lured me out of retirement, you might say. My charming personality. When I was an agent for High King Emric, I traveled widely and met many dignitaries, including Lord Bacaro. He asked me to make sure everything went smoothly for his conference. So far, it's been anything but. The gentleman beside me, Lord Bacaro Valoris, leads the Society of the Steadfast. They're a philanthropic fellowship that provides aid to people who have suffered in the Three Banners War. The society is sponsoring a conference here on the island. That's a well-guarded secret, my dear. Perhaps after you've proven yourself, I can bring you in on the details. Hmm. For the moment, no, knowing any more won't help us find out what happened to my missing ships. That's not an option I care to contemplate. Not while there's still a chance to find them. Forgive me for being evasive, but it's a rather sensitive topic to discuss in public. We've already faced adversity, and the conference has yet to begin. Certainly. Since you're new to High Isle, I understand you may not be as familiar with the local area as I am. The ancient Anchor Inn sits just up the street near the city gate. It's one of the more popular places on the island. In my experience, inns are an excellent location to pick up rumors. Gonfalon Head Lighthouse, blessed by Kinnereth herself, stands atop the hill just west of town. It offers an excellent vantage from which to watch the nearby waters. Perhaps the lighthouse keeper saw something that will help. Possibly. When ships fail to make port, it's only natural to wonder if they were damaged or blown off course by a storm. The lighthouse keeper has a perfect view of the approach to Gonfalon Bay. If my ships were out there, she might have seen them. The currents of Lockerbane are strong. Flotsam from the open sea often washes up along the shores of the waterway. Some of High Isle's poorer folk comb the beach looking for salvage. Let's hope they haven't found any today. Wherever you think is best, my dear. But do get started soon. My intuition tells me that some sort of mischief is afoot, and my intuition is rarely wrong. I hear these knights are robbing people and looting caravans. Someone ought to do something. Have you heard about the band of robber knights that waylay travelers on the Gonfalon Bay? Can't that it just stand on by itself? I have to trade, but getting goods from the interior has become a roll of the dice. A rogue band that calls itself the Ascendant Order. I thought they were only active on the mainland, but they're here on High Isle. Rabble rousers and troublemakers, if you ask me. And now I hear they're looting caravans outside the city walls. Not specifically, but I saw some fancy pants nobles giving the dockmaster grief. Missing ships could mean anything. Storms, pirates, poor winds, worthless navigators. Try Sergeant Dane over there. He's with the Sisters Guard and knows a lot. What's kind of musta halti? Hey yo, son tam tama. I'm off duty, newcomer. Got a complaint? Take it to one of the other guards. We police High Isle. Ships that haven't arrived yet aren't our problem. 
Besides, we've got our hands full with these so-called Ascendant Order Knights. They're stirring up trouble all across the island. Just that they're little more than well-armed bandits. They've been recruiting the poor to bolster their numbers. Now they're robbing caravans while claiming they fight for justice. <laughs> Honest folk don't hide their faces behind helmets and masks. They're malcontents. They go on about how the high and mighty misuse their power by squabbling over the ruby throne. It started out small enough. Defying authority, inciting riots, petty sabotage. But now they're hurting. Something else, newcomer? I'd like to get back to my drink. Ordinary bandits, the sisters' guard can handle. But when we send enough guards to meet a company of ascendant order ravagers, these faceless knights just melt away. And if we don't send enough guards? And our guards don't come back. Might as well be. Most knights proudly display their elves. They wear the colors of their house and paint family crests on their shields. These ascendant order knights never remove their helms and bear no devices. They could. Okay, what the fuck is that? Ah, so. Kiva, kun tuo musiikki on vähän enemmän keskiaikasta tällä kertaa. Sitten. <laughs> Record the press. Oh, this is not good. Rigard needs help. Rigard, sometimes called the brash, and I am large delegate for the Ebon Artifact Cultural Exchange, or I would be if I had my scepter. <laughs> that does. What King Yoran told me. He said, Rigard, go to High Island, be Ebonheart Fact Cultural Ambassador, and be large, delegate, and large. <laughs> that is me. <laughs> but I lost my scepter of office. I had it with me last night, but now I can't find it. Yes, I went out with delegates Tanilin and Olganash last night. We ate and drank like kings. I don't remember all that happened, but I spent most of my gold, and I lost my official scepter. <sighs> I've been thinking very hard, and it hurt. Uh, we should begin at the ancient anchor. That is where I went last night with the other diplomats. The innkeeper was angry with me this morning, but she might talk to you. Meet you there. Rigard leads glorious expedition of Nord cultural exchange. Yeah, that that that's so Yes, yes. One day, Rigard was drinking in the Scald King's hall and loudly explaining all the good things people don't know about Nords. King Joran said he knew that already, and I should go tell somebody else. So, I did! They are delegates too. Tanilin is very important elf from Aldmeri Dominion, and Olganash is noble orc from Daggerfall. Orc culture. Mm. culture wherever he goes. I don't remember what we talked about. It must have been another diplomatic success. Catastrophe. Uh, must think again. Uh, no. Departed ways with great enthusiasm in street just outside the ancient anchor. I went back inside and I had it with me then. I need my scepter of office. I can't lose another <laughs> one. Or <laughs> <I'll go laughs> my I'm sorry, but I'm very busy. I'll get to you just as soon. Not 
I'm sorry about that little scene. And she I'm sorry about that little I must have committed great diplomacy last night. Ask her about my scepter, friend. I'm sorry about that little scene. Some people are unbelievable. Welcome to the ancient anchor. What can I do? Oh, you're with this Nord? <laughs> I'm not all that worried about what he left here. I'm worried about what he took. A night's worth of food, drink, and entertainment. All without paying. He and his friends skipped out on their bill. Like I said, they ate and drank all night in a private room. When I noticed it was too quiet, I looked in and they were all gone. Someone's got to settle up. Your friend left his scepter? It'll do as collateral until I get paid. Ah, that is good. And I remember now. I wanted to pay the bill to impress the other delegates, but... Now I don't have the coin to do that again. We have to get them to pay their shares. I can't lose another scepter. Let me see. Danilin didn't seem to be having fun, so I bought her a special drink. And then Olganash wanted dessert. I asked the man in the back for something sweet so my friends could have a good time. We headed back to our own lodgings after that. Niin pahalta. Oh yes, I am good diplomat. So I thought she would like something. We all laughed and had fun. <laughs> we said good night just outside. She got in her carriage and drove off for home. We might have been arguing about where to get the best cake in Rothgar. <laughs> that made us want cake. But the man in the back room said he did not have cake. So I asked him to give me whatever he had. For Oganash. I think Tanilin is staying at Steadfast Manor, a little way outside of town. She likes Lord Bakaro's gardens. Olganash rented a small house in Gonfalon Bay near the West Gate. Here, I'll be right behind you. Win my head stop. <laughs> can you help me? This has been a terrible mistake. I'm with the Daggerfall Covenant diplomatic mission. But this guard doesn't believe me. Uh -huh. I'm not what he thinks I am. Rigard! He got me into this mess. Last night after dinner, we were talking about our favorite places in Rothgar. He disappeared into the back and returned with a bag. He said something about getting a dessert for me. I left. On my way home, <laughs> and he put the other thing. I told him what I hey, bye, bye, bye. He frisked me. It turns out the bag was filled with skooma. I didn't know. I swear. Can you talk to Sergeant Dupertus? I've got diplomatic immunity. You'd better talk to the guard. I'm sure Alden Ash spun you a sad tale. Criminals will say just about anything to avoid going <laughs> now, to prison. Now, what's going to be that? Me was a diplomat. <laughs> Hope he's got a better story for the city magistrate. If I had a gold coin for every criminal who tells me he's got friends in high places, I'd be a wealthy man. Word of warning, mainlander. Make false statements to an officer of the law, and you'll be in front of the magistrate too. <sighs> I'll free Olganash if we catch the criminal who refined the moon sugar. There's a smuggler named Burjack Catalan who hangs around the ancient anchor. We're sure he deals in skooma, but we haven't been able to prove it. He's the criminal I really want. Follow Burjack Catalan and find where he keeps his contraband. I'll need you to bring me proof he's got skooma. Tried to arrest him before, only to come up empty-handed. I saw Burjack in Gonfalon Square earlier. If you're in, start there. You are very clever, friend. <laughs> Just find Burjack Catalon's ill-gotten booty, and I'll get my scepter back. It's simple. Hey, Ola. What a night. Time for a little nightcap. What are you up to? Be about your business and leave me alone. Melkoinen hyvä ollut kaverilla.
Jopa se kiertää ne. Aha, menee tonne. More importantly, did you bring back any proof that he's dealing in skooma? Someone has to go to prison today. I'd rather take him than your friend here. I knew it! Thank you, Mainlander. We've been trying for months to catch Burjack Catalan with incriminating evidence, but he can smell a guard from a block away. He hides it all before we get anywhere near him. I'm true to my word. I'm after the smuggler who's bringing skooma into my town. Not some drunken fool who ends up with a vial in his pocket. But tell your friend if I see him anywhere near Moon Sugar again, I'll arrest him on the spot. Excellent! <laughs> Ulganash has paid his debt to society. Another <laughs> diplomatic triumph. Oh, that's better. I can't thank you enough. Without your help, I'd still be under arrest. Now, what's all this about Rigard and his missing scepter? No one paid the innkeeper? I don't understand. We ate and drank quite a lot last night, but Rigard said he'd taken care of it. I would never <laughs> skip the out on Phil. We have to make this right. What do you need me to do? Gladly. I'll head back to my rooms and clean myself up. As soon as I can feel my fingers again, ja se oli vähän tiukasti vedetty nippu sitten. It's the least I can do. Ex. I can't believe Olganash got himself arrested. Sitten steadfast Manorille. Dock hands are watching for your cargo, Lady Arabelle. They know it's precious. There was a storm off the coast. Perhaps it delayed the ships. Forgive me if I do the job you hired me for, Lord Bakara. You there. Might we speak? Näköjään toi eventti voi tapahtua sitten monessa paikassa. Like the type who could go traipsing around dangerous areas in search of rare ingredients. Could I interest you in a job? There's coin in it for you, and the knowledge that you'd be bringing joy to many in Gonfalon Bay. My partner and I are purveyors and creators of fine drinks. Uh -huh. Hilgrim does more drinking than creating, however, which got us into our current trouble. We were on the cusp of making a groundbreaking new spirit. Then Hilgrim drank our entire supply. 
We need three ingredients to make another batch, and Hilgrim's in no state to get them himself. The drink requires flesh flies, a sister's passion flower, and a druid's bane mushroom. If I marked the locations on your map, would you gather them? Yo, totta kai. Here, these spots should have the ingredients I mentioned. Tämä onkin perinteinen keräilytehtävä. Bring them back. I can whip up a drink that's sure to make all the mainlanders empty out their pockets. So long as I can keep Hilgrim away from me. Niin pelätöstä. Hilgrim and I are always experimenting with different flavors and ingredients. Not all of them are successful, of course, but this combination in particular was exceedingly delicious. We stumbled upon something revolutionary. I'm sure of it. We've only just met, lovely stranger. I can't go giving you all our secrets just yet. Hilgrim and I have a special technique when it comes to the blending, but truthfully, we can't take all the credit. The local ingredients play a major role. Hmm. The flesh fly wings add a bit of bitterness and body to the drink. The sister's passion flower gives it a lovely floral aftertaste and a lovely color. And that particular type of mushroom infuses a great deal of sweetness and heaviness to the mix. Yes, this place brings in rich nobles by the bucketful. Or at least it used to before those delegates came around. But there are still enough gadabouts to take advantage of. People who will pay almost anything for a taste of something different. Well, you wouldn't know it by looking at him right now, but he's actually a very charming, intelligent, uh -huh. passionate man. We fell in love over a bottle of Alto wine years ago, and discovered we both had a gift for concocting delicious libations. He makes me want to tear my hair out most days. But yes, we are. As much as he vexes me, he makes me laugh too. And he has incredible ideas. It was his notion to use the flesh flies to add a hint of bitterness to the drink. <sighs> Just brilliant. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, need to on. Tossa, tossa, yeah. Fresh cauldron. Yep. Se on muuten iso ritari. Ja. Tää muussa pomotappelussa ehkä pitäisi enemmän tätä testata. Mutta helti, helti niinku hiilauskykyä nyt tällä hetkellä yhtään tämän. Can't tell me. So when I said they are say say you step back when some of the young people promote up below, then so that the Satan Ola by he is would allow her more. Varmaan vaan hankkia teille paremmat varusteet ja aseet toistaiseksi. Tää vähän nostaa tasoja sitten teille. Ä. 
Ouch. Oh, no. No muut, muut tosiaan niinku hoitetaan. Me oltiin vaan mukana niin sanotusti. Slay a sunset deck fragment. Aa, sieltä voi jonkun dekin saada näitä tuhoamalla. No, tää on hoidettu. 